Yo, what's going on, y'all? It's Combo Breaker 99 back on the Jab Effect. Make sure y'all subscribe. Just back with this real quick video here, my post fight reaction to Ryan Garcia knocking out Francisco Fonseca. Um, all, all he needed was uh, a minute, a minute and a half into the first round. That's all Ryan Garcia needed to take out Fonseca, and this would make a big statement. You know, shout out to Ryan Garcia. You know, he's a young kid coming up, and uh, you know, he's he's pretty energetic. He's always out there showing his energy. And uh, I know when he first hit the scene, you know, I was kind of like, what's this kid talking about? You know, he was always like showing showing off and online, you know, I would see him on Instagram posting the pictures of him hitting the speed bag and everything and um, hitting the target miss. And, then, you know, I was like, yo, I got to see something out of this kid. And um, I've been seeing a little bit more and more. That's kind of been impressing me as far as uh, what he's bringing to the table on his level. But uh, after taking this kid out, name, you know, after taking this uh, guy, you know, uh, Bonsick out, you know, who was a common opponent of Tank Davis. I'm like, yo, man, like, let's go ahead and get him in there with some of these these next level fights that's going to push him up the ladder. You know, um, guys like, uh, you know, Devin Haney, Devin Haney came into the ring after this fight. And, you know, he stated he wanted to make this fight. You know, these guys have history. You know, these guys have fought what was it, like six times in the amateurs. And, um, you know, they they kind of go way back on, you know, their come up. And now that they're both in the game, you know, uh, Devin Haney is a champion. Uh, Ryan Garcia, you know, he wants to be champion. You know, he's already saying it's a Devin Haney's face that, hey, that's his belt. He should be champion. Well, you know, let's go ahead and make these fights. You know, um, let's not try to wait and marinate or try to milk these things. You know, people want to see big fights now. And that's how it's supposed to go down. You know, um, I mean, the money's going to be there, you know, and that's something I want to talk about in another video or on another ep uh, podcast episode. Uh, you know, uh, Ryan, uh, Devin, Devin Haney and his father, you know, they approached B-Hop approached Bernard Hopkins after this fight about you know potentially fighting Ryan Garcia they said it right there in front of media and everybody that they want this fight you know and um you know B-Hop for once he was kind of at a loss for words on this one you know and um in so many words after the uh after the call out after Devin Haney said his piece you know B-Hop he basically was saying that he feels like this fight has to be marinated and you know he's he's a guy that had a rough road coming up and he knows that everybody wants their shot at the title and somebody like Devin Haney he wants a shot at superstardom you know um he's, he's got a belt right now but he also wants to put the names on his resume you know I've seen people online saying who who is Ryan Garcia fought or or not Ryan Garcia but who is Devin Haney fought well he wants these fights so people can't say that anymore you know he wants to put a tank he wants to put a Lomachenko he wants to put a De Ryan Garcia on his resume you know, but it's like these guys don't want to fight. So you can't say who is he for. No, who is who he's trying to fight or who's ducking it, you know. So all in all, man, you know, Ryan Garcia and Devin Haney, it's the fight to make right now. You know, no need to wait because we don't know what might happen with these guys out the ring or, you know, in the ring. You know, one of these guys might take an L before then or something might happen. You know, somebody might, God forbid, you know, something that, you know, personal might happen in their lives that kind of, you know, mess something up. You know, we, we saw with the Spence and Crawford matchup. So, uh, you know, these guys might as well do it now. I mean, they could fight as many times as they want, you know, just take it back to the old school days. You know, if they are the best of the best, then they are going to see each other more than once, you know. But that's all I got on this one now, guys. Like I said, Ryan Garcia, he did what he was supposed to do in this fight, make this statement. Um, you know, he just set this whole fight up with the left hand, good solid jab, good quick jab, and, you know, um, set it up with that good check left hook as uh, Fonseca stepped in. And as you can see in the picture, that's all she wrote. But that's all I got on this, guys. Make sure y'all subscribe. Jab Effect. Also, subscribe to my YouTube channel, Combo Breaker 99. I'm out. Peace.